bonsoir mon amis. Yeah. Ryan here, back with another video. Yeah, and since I made a video about the damage to my floors from the flood and all, I better make a video of my other gaming collections as well. And here's one I never really talked about, but I figure I should know. That was the perfect time. And it's another underrated system like the TurboGrass 16. But I'm sure there's a called phone for it as well. <laughs> I can't say phone. <laughs> no, no, I can. Well, anyways, this is just me, Star Soldier Orion, on May 11, 2011, making a collection video on my Sega Master System. Ooh. Let's have a closer look, shall we? Oh, yeah. Here is my Sega. Sega. Scope 3D bots. Oh yeah. <laughs> this is the only Sega Master System I have in the bots here. There it is. Now the cool thing about this system or this collection here is that it came with the game Maze or Missile Defense 3D. I was about to say Maze Hunter, but no. Yeah, this game is very <laughs> crazy because Yeah, you actually need two peripherals. You need the light gun. And <laughs> you also need the 3D glasses for that game to work. And no, it doesn't actually look like that. But still, the game is pretty good. I recommend it. Yeah, and that system right there is actual system that you get. Because it has actually Maze or <laughs> Missile Defense 3D. Why am I always thinking of Maze Hunter? Well, anyways, <laughs> that's my point. Yeah, there's my lone boss of the Sega 3D glasses. Again, I figure it would be nice to have the bots too, so I bought that separately. There's a Sega Sports Pad, a very awkward to use controller, which wasn't very popular, but hey, I got the bots anyway, so. Yeah, it's very different. It's like one of those classic trap ball controllers, but think of it as much, much worse. <laughs> it's probably one of the worst controllers out there, let's just say that. And here are the games. Hopefully you can see that okay. Yeah, I'll lower this a bit <laughs> because it's kind of dark. Yeah, this is my Sega Master System actual game collection. I have a lot of these in bots. There are my card games in the corner there. Yeah. Got a lot of legends in there. Yeah, there's about 95 to 97 games least here in the US and yeah there are even more exclusive games released in Canada here as well yeah if you don't know the Star Soldier I'm actually a uh, Canadian eh? <laughs> we have some European and Canadian exclusives like Ultimate 4, The Terminator, Tennis Ace, Super Space Invaders, yep. Spy vs Spy in the bots, not in the card. Yep, shout out the beast. Scramble sp <laughs> spirits. Try saying that three times fast. <laughs> Sagaya. Yep, Rampage. RC Grand Prix, which was also released out in the US, but it was actually released by a different company, not by Sega. Miss Patman, yeah, the legend. Yep, I actually got a triple card there. Martsman Shootin', Trap Shootin', and Safari Hunt. Three light gun games in one collection. Yep, Golf Mania, Galaxy Force, the non Activision version. Die my duds! <laughs> yeah, not a very good game. Double Hawk, Cyborg Hunter, yep, Captain Silver, the actual 2 megabyte edition. Yeah, you have to see that down there. Yeah. And we also got Bomber Raid, Aerial Assault, American Pro Football, and yeah, Bomber Raid. Yeah, and Battle Outrun. Okay. Yeah, I also got a collection of controllers down here. Okay. Here are the glasses. And here's just one Sega Master System controller. Here's the Sega Master System controller after they got rid of the whole stick 
on the top here. Yeah, they're worried about kids choking on them. So, yeah, they actually covered up the stick part with these little buns here. Yeah, and here's the original model of the Sega Master System controller. Here we got the cord coming out of the side, and we have a stick on there. It was actually considered a choking hazard to actually have this on here because it's removable. Yeah, and here we have an arcade stick, which I'm not a big fan of because, yeah, <laughs> yeah, it kind of had to be left handed to use it. But at least Sega was catered to lefties there. There's a Pro Base Converter, which you can use on the Sega Genesis Model 1, play your Sega Master System games. Yep. Here's the Phaser. Yeah. This is actually called the Zillion Gun or something. Here's the Sega Master System 2, which unfortunately doesn't play the 3D and card games. But it has Oh, it's kid built in, which is awesome. And it's actually a revised version of Alex Kid Miracle World because the controls are actually inverted, so they're more easier to use. <laughs> kind of like the Super Mario Brothers. Plus, you actually see Alex Kid eat hamburgers. <laughs> oh, yeah. Here's a closer look at some of my games. Yeah, I have these games in the corner, so the lighting is not the best here. But at least they're all safe. And some of these games, yeah, they are again hard to find. Yeah, there's actually an elf game there. There's American Baseball, Big Tracy, Double Dragon, Fantasy Zone The Maze, or Fantasy Zone 3, Kind of Plays by Batman. World Soccer, Great Soccer, yep, probably one of the rarest Sega Master System games, James Buster Douglas Knockout Botson, sadly I don't have the bots for, Poseidon Wars, 3D, yeah, here's a rare game that's actually in the blue label, Reggie Jackson Baseball. Secret Command, which is an alternate version of Rambo, and Son the Hedgehog 2. Yeah, and that's my Sega Master System collection. Again, I'm very proud of this system. Very underrated. And actually in Canada and Europe, the system was much more popular. In Europe, there's like over 300 games you can find. So, yeah, I say give this system a chance. Yeah, and I have the complete uh, U.S. releases though, but yeah, my song with the Hedgehog down there is not the U.S. one because it doesn't have the sticker on it. <laughs> but, you know, I don't care about that. I just want to play the game. <laughs> that's the way I am. I only have one game here that's actually factory sealed. But the only reason I have this factory sealed is because I have an error copy down here I could easily play, so. I don't like the idea of having game that's factory sealed. <laughs> I gotta play it. <laughs> okay. So yeah, this is just proof if I lose this in the flood. Yeah, insurance company, I had all these games before. Okay, this Star Soldier, over and out. <laughs>